Best case management is either revolutionary or rocket science. Uh, it is common sense good practice. When implemented, uh, it will improve the way uh, in which cases are processed through the system to the benefit of all concerned. Some principal aims. Robust case management, a reduced number of hearings, maximum participation and engagement from every participant within the system, and compliance, and I do mean compliance, with the criminal procedure rules, practice direction, and court directions. A part of better case management, but not the whole, is a national early guilty plea scheme. We are interested in an early guilty plea scheme for some very obvious reasons. The vast majority of cases uh, in the CJS do not go to trial. They result in guilty pleas. The Uniform National Scheme will form part of the Criminal Procedure Rules 2015 and the Case Management Practice Direction 2015. Uh, these come into force on the 5th October this year. Once the case emerges from the Magistrates' Court, it will be sent to a mandatory first hearing in the Crown Court within 28 days nationally. The name for the first hearing, I'm sorry, it doesn't exactly trip off the tongue, but it's going to be called the Plea and Trial Preparation Hearing, abbreviated perhaps unhelpfully to PTPH, uh, but it should do exactly as its name suggests. It must be more uh, than the current preliminary hearing. It should generate either a, a guilty plea and a sentence uh, or directions taking the case on towards trial. It will be using a carefully designed PTPH form uh, and I expect and hope uh, that that form will be properly used ideally filled in by practitioners in advance and, and used carefully by judges at the hearing. Now, in many cases, uh, as I think many here know, it should be possible to move from PTPH to trial. One of the aims of the scheme uh, is to reduce the number of pre-trial hearings. Uh, in others, uh, that would be wrong or unrealistic uh, and the new rules provide for a further case management hearing.